Yo, what's up guys? Uh, didn't die yet. I want to apologize for such inconsistent uploads, as well as, you know, not the longest or highest quality videos. Between school, work, and taking care of a puppy, I'm completely and utterly gassed. I feel like I'm gonna die. Like, I went to stream this Wednesday, laid down on the floor at 2.30, and I woke up at 7 p.m. But anyways, enough about that, you're here for the build. And the whole point of this build is distracting survivors long enough to get off your devour help. So first off, the natophobia, it doesn't really do that much, but when survivors notice it, they have a tendency to want to heal more often. Why? I don't know. But this will distract survivors, make them want to heal more, and if they want to heal more, that's more time being wasted. Hex the third seal. People always say this perk isn't very good, that blindness isn't that good of a status effect, but permanent blindness is actually a pretty big deal and it's going to waste a lot of their time finding slugs, finding exactly where the hook is, if they might have missed where you were hooked, it might be an indoor map. This will slow the game down a lot. Both of these perks exist to stall the game out long enough for me to get my Devour Hope up, which you know what this perk does. You get more tokens. The more tokens you get from survivors being unhooked, you become stronger and stronger and stronger until you can literally just instantly kill people like you have a Mori. And then obviously we're running Undying to protect our perks and stall the game out. Basically the only shot they have is if they immediately just start rushing down totems, they destroy my Undying and then they get my Devour Hope first. And even then, I'll still have Third Seal. Not bad, I still think Third Seal is a good perk. Anyway, so let's get into the content. I'm trying to hit 1000 subs on YouTube, please. Alright. Fracture Cowshed, let's do it. So for add-ons, I'm basically running the green add-on that increases the recharge speed of my blinks. As well as the purple add-on that makes me undetectable whenever I hit people with a blink attack. You can run whatever add-ons, they don't really matter that much. Not a good start. I have corn vision, I have corn vision. I'm blind. That's one stack of the third seal. And I'm gonna undershoot that blink. Damn. Alright, there goes my undying, unfortunate. Okay. Interesting. Gotta get you off of that totem, girl. That's three people with Devour Help on, or Third Seal on them, which is very good for me. That person just had to finish with Generator. Works for me. And that's a stack, baby. No idea where the other person is. Very cool, very cool, Mandy. Thank you. Oh, they can't find the slug, actually. Are you sure about that? Well, now they can. Yeah, they can't find the slug because of, a, uh, Or they couldn't because of... Third seal. Uh, of course, I went back to this gen. Third stack. Third stack. Third stack. Third stack. Unhooker. Unhooker. Nice. That's what I'm talking about. Ah, uh, feels good, man. Oh, I see some scratch marks. Where are you hiding? Where are you going? Where do you think you're going? Oh! That was a bad blink. And then you go this way? There we go. Good news everybody, we're almost at five stacks. I know there's someone nearby, but I'm gonna let them get that way. I'm gonna run this way. Boom. Shh. Shh. I'm undetectable, they can't see me. I'm sorry. Later, bitch. Smart. Well, see ya. Ah, you love to see it. Oh, I haven't hooked you once this entire game. See ya. Go. Oh, 
Oh, next up on the list, too. See ya. No! No, don't do it! Oh my god, I love Devour Hope when it works. Ah. Ah, oh, man, you love to see it. Oh, that high action, safety pip, rank one gameplay, baby.